undoubtedly try to sneak their way into our home. So I say, let them. Let us welcome them with open arms. And let us give them a welcome they'll never forget. <laughs> Bradley's in the van? No, we'll take a look at the house already. It's obvious somebody else is home. It's not a number. Okay, just get a shot of Dwayne. Remember, the other one is too risky. You get a photo of Dwayne, I can get us back in there tomorrow. I'll get in there tonight. Do what I say, Artie. Hey, don't fuck with me. I'm professional. Get ready to burn some rubber. He just sits in the basket and stares. I think he's dying. I... What? No. No, I can't move. He... No. No. He's up in the attic. He's too weak to come down. I... What? Okay. Okay. Blau? Blau, can you hear me? Granny went to get you some medicine. I'll go down in the basement and get some blankets and bring them up to you. What? No. No, I told him that. I told him you can't move. I told him there was no way I could bring you there. He said, wait until tomorrow. Shh. Hold it. I thought I heard something. I better go look. afraid I'm not gonna hurt you you don't feel good so I just want you to relax take a few pictures and then I'll be gone it's kind of dark in here so I'm gonna have to use a flash it's gonna be a big burst of light but don't let it upset you just relax sit back and say cheese <laughs> Hey! <laughs> 
better be good. Phil, this is Marcy Elliott. Uh, I need your help. I'm in big trouble. Uh, can it wait till tomorrow? I think Artie's been killed. What do you mean, Artie's been killed? You remember the Times Square Freak Twins? Yeah. Well, I found them. In a house in Staten Island belonging to Ruth Smoller. Dr. Freak? Yeah. That's a name I haven't heard in many years. I once had a liberator freak from that commune of hers she had out west. Oh. Not pleasant. Look, I want Dwayne. Before I go to the police, I want to speak to Dwayne. Well, walking into her house and asking for him just won't work. You gotta get Dwayne to come out. Get him to come out, sit down, and shoot the breeze. Hello? Don't hang up. Or I'll be at your front door in five minutes with a shitload of cops. You dig? Who is this? Let me speak to Dwayne. There's no one here. Put him on the phone, or I'll have a cavalry knocking down your front door. Just a minute. For you. It's working. Who is this? This is someone who knows who you are and who your brother is. Am I making myself clear? What do you want? I want to talk, Dwayne. I want to meet you face to face. Have a few beers. Talk about life. Without your brother, of course. Phil, I've been looking forward to meeting you. You working with that reporter? Sort of. We're uh, old friends. But it's just you and me tonight, OK? What do you want? Well, for starters, I want to know what happened to another old friend of mine, a guy named Artie. He walked into that house you're living in now, and he never came out. It never happened. I think he did. And I think he met your brother. 